And next up, another young man making his Grand Prix debut, Paul Fentz of Germany, 25 years old, four-time German national silver medalist. Opening jump, the quadruple combination. Quadro oh, can't get over the right side in time. Today is gonna be the day that they're gonna throw it back to you. By now, you should have somehow realized what you got to do. I don't believe in anybody feels the way. Quick turnaround I do. here into the triple axle. Very nicely saved. A little hesitation on that takeoff. It's very efficient to the rotating position. Sure, you heard it all before, but you never really had any doubt. And all the roads we have to walk are winding. And all the lights that lead us there are blinding. There are many things that I'd like to say to you. Triple Hutz out of footwork, throws on the triple toe, salvaging as many points as he can. Throwback Friday for the music for the short program so far for the men, right? Absolutely. All three oldies. But when you're in this first warm up and you want to make a stab at skating the free program in the second flight, you cannot make mistakes, especially on the big ticket items. Smart to get the combo in late, but when you leave, the quad without that positive grade of execution, it's very difficult to make up the points on the powerhouses that are yet to come. Oh, you can see the look on his face. And this is a big opportunity for Fence. He was not originally selected for Skate Canada. He got in off of the alternates list when um, a couple of skaters withdrew. Like Mikhail Virginia also in. Here's a look at that opening quad, just a little quick. You don't see the full draw through the takeoff getting in too fast. They'll definitely take a look at the landing. Much better on the triple axle. But you have to create that rhythm and let the momentum carry through the entirety of the takeoff. The moment you start pulling away from your own momentum and working against yourself, you move less efficiently, and that makes it very difficult in an item where the margin for error is so slim, like these quads. Paul was 20th at Worlds in Helsinki, and that did qualify a spot for Germany at the Olympics. Oh, 
But he has to think that his performance on the Grand Prix will set him up to either make that team or leave the door open for Peter Liebers, who has shown in the past that he can deliver at the Olympic Games. Taking a long time here on the Never replay screen. Never a good screen. sign, right? Never a good sign. A couple of those spins were very suspect as to if he attained the position or held long enough. 68.48, that's about nine points lower than what he scored at Finlandia Trophy earlier this fall. But based on that technical score, it looks like they gave him the under 